He questioned his girlfriend, is it gonna be like this every time you go out to sea? If Polly's the one who's trying to convince his girlfriend to go home. Then suddenly a huge wave came and the cabin flooded again. After a few big waves, they finally found the stranded half of the ship. But by this time, the ship's engines were flooded. Everyone fled to the deck, and was very happy. But soon Polly realized, they can only carry 12 people in this small boat, but there are at least 30 people on board, so he decided to take a gamble and get everyone on board the boat. Soon the boat was full. Half of the cruise ship sank before the eyes of the people, someone who really knows the sea, not just on the surface. Currents and winds are his compass. Polly relied on the wind to get the group home. A hurricane slowly passed and the sea leveled off, but the town suddenly lost power, and the lighthouse did not work. Finally, everyone parked their cars at the dock, and their headlights guided Polly and his men. It was because of this that Polly and his men saw the